On the holiday of Sukkot, God instructed us to live in a sukkah for seven days. A sukkah is a temporary hut covered with branches and leaves. We commemorate the glorious times when God took us out of Egypt and cover, covered us with the clouds of glory, protecting us <clears throat> from the heat and from the scorpions. And therefore, we commemorate by going out of our house and dwelling in a sukkah for seven days. <clears throat> we also have a special mitzvah, the divine commandment from God on the holiday to be very joyous more than the other holidays. <clears throat> but wouldn't it be more joyous if we can celebrate the holiday in the comfort of our home and have the festive meals versus being outdoors in the temporary hut and in most places it's already getting cold and rainy and it's not very comfortable. How is that very joyous? <clears throat> but the Torah is teaching us a very essential message. And that is, there's a difference between simcha, joy, and gratification. Gratification comes from things, physical pleasures, materialism. Joy comes from the soul. And the difference is, gratification doesn't last long because it comes from physical things which are limited. And therefore, <clears throat> we constantly need to have more things in order to stimulate ourselves. However, when one experiences joy from the soul, that's permitted, that's lasting. Because the soul is godly. And in the place of God, there's confidence and joy. When one tunes into the soul, you can really experience a sense of joy. And this is why God commanded us to have this most joyous holiday, celebrating outdoors in the temporary hut, where you're not so comfortable. Why? <clears throat> because real joy doesn't come from a comfortable house and from physical things. Real joy comes from the soul and comes from doing Hashem's mitzvah and connecting to God through the mitzvah. And therefore, when we go out into the sukkah, where it's not very comfortable, but we, we're doing the mitzvah of Hashem, of living in a sukkah, that connects us to Hashem, and that gives us a real sense of joy from the soul, not from things. And that's what the Zohar says, that the sukkah is called Tzila Dim Heinusa. It's the shade of faith. When we sit in the sukkah, God lights, embraces us, and that gives us the greatest sense of joy and confidence. Have a very happy Sukkos.